Hey, did you know that you can add your own audio files onto CapCut? So let's say that you did a voiceover or something like that on a really nice mic, the way that I'm doing it right now, and you wanna add it to um, you know, CapCut. I'm gonna show you how you can easily do this. You could also do this for like your own music if you uh, create music on Logic or something like that, and you wanna import your own song into CapCut, this is also going to work. So uh, first off, let's go ahead and open up CapCut here. Okay, once we're inside app, uh, CapCut, we just wanna go into one of our projects or we wanna create a new project. I'm just gonna go into one of my existing projects. When we are in this existing project, uh, we wanna make sure that we are not selected on any of the content here or else this is not gonna work. So we wanna uh, tap off of uh, any content okay then we want to go down here to where it says sounds so I'm going to select sounds now the first tab here is going to give you like all the the TikTok sounds what we want to do is get our own sound so I'm going to go over to the folders uh, tab right here and we can extract a sound from a video but in case we want to have like our own voiceover that we did outside of CapCut or put in our own song, then what we wanna do is go to device, okay? So if we select device, you're gonna see all of the all of the files that you already added, which if you're watching this video, then you, you probably didn't. So we wanna to go to select from device. Once we're in select from device, then we are going to see uh, all of the audio files that we have on here. So um, in case you don't have like, you're like, well, how do I get my song actually in here? Then what you're going to want to do is, you know, airdrop it from your computer into, uh, your, your iPhone and save it in files. And then you can access it from there. Same thing. I'm going to show you one extra thing here. Let's say like you did your, um, let's say that you did your voiceover on voice memos. Okay. Well, what you can do is you can uh, select the voiceover and select the three dots, and then you're gonna go to save to files, right? And then just make sure that you know exactly where you're saving it. I'm gonna go ahead and select save, right? I already did this, so I'll just go ahead and select replace, okay? So that's how you access um, the, the uh, files inside of CapCut, okay? So if you don't have anything save it coming up here, then you're gonna want to make sure that you have some audio files in your, <laughs> your files. I'm saying files over and over again. And then, you know, to add it to the video, then we're just gonna go ahead and select it. And then we want to go to open, okay? So now we will then be able to find it right here. So I can just go ahead and add, and then it's going to drop it in and uh, add that audio file for me. So. Hopefully this video helped you out. If it did, like, subscribe, and I'll see you next time.